Norm MacDonald, former Saturday Night Live comic, dies comedian Norm MacDonald, a former Saturday Night Live writer and performer who was Weekend Update host when Bill Clinton and O.J. Simpson provided comic fodder during the 1990s, has died MacDonald, who was 61, died Tuesday after having cancer for nine years, but keeping it private, according to Brillstein Entertainment Partners, his management firm in Los Angeles. He never reached the same television heights after being fired from SNL in 1998, but was an indefatigable stand-up comic and popular talk show guest whose death provoked an outpouring from fellow comedians. Norm was in a comedy genre of his own, tweeted Sarah Silverman. No one like him on this planet. Please do yourself a favor and watch his stuff. McDonald, the son of two schoolteachers, was raised in Quebec City, Canada. Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau offered his condolences, calling him a comedic genius and a great Canadian. He was a stand-up comic and briefly a writer for the sitcom, Roseanne, when he was picked to join the cast of Saturday Night Live in 1993. He became known for his esoteric impressions, including Burt Reynolds, who gave Will Ferrell's Alex Trebek character grief on Celebrity Jeopardy. He also impersonated Bob Dole, Larry King, and David Letterman. His deadpan style and skills as a writer made him the choice to host Weekend Update. Simpson was a favorite target. McDonald opened the fake newscast the week of the former football star's acquittal on murder charges by saying, Well, it's finally official. Murder is legal in the state of California. Saturday Night Live executive producer Lorne Michaels, speaking for the show, called McDonald one of the most impactful comedic voices of his or any other generation. There are so many things that we'll miss about Norm, from his unflinching integrity to his generosity to his consistent ability to surprise, he said. But most of all he was just plain funny. No one was funny like Norm. McDonald was fired in the middle of the season in 1998 by NBC Entertainment executive Don Ulmeyer, a friend of Simpsons who reportedly didn't appreciate the SNL star making Simpson the near-constant butt of jokes I was never bitter, McDonald said in the oral history live from New York, released in 2002. I always understood that Ulmeyer could fire me, because he was the guy who owned the cameras, so that didn't bother me. I was always happy that SNL gave me a chance. He said in the same book that I just like doing jokes I like, and if the audience doesn't like them, they're wrong, not me. Olmeyer said that was his problem when Saturday Night Live is really good, they do care what the audience thinks, he said. And when in Saturday Night Live is not really good, they're kind of doing it for themselves and their pals. McDonald went on Letterman's show to announce that he was fired. During a commercial break, Letterman asked him, this is like some Andy Kaufman thing with fake wrestling, right? McDonald recalled. But it wasn't that Letterman was a fan who made McDonald one of the guests in the CBS Late Show host's final run of shows. In 2016, Letterman told the Washington Post that the show would have had McDonald on every week if we could. He is funny in a way that some people inhale and exhale, Letterman told the Post. With others, you can tell the comedy, the humor is considered. With Norm, he exudes it. There may be people as funny as Norm, but I don't know anybody who is funnier. The Post story was headlined, Will somebody please give Norm McDonald another show? As if to answer, Netflix two years later aired 10 episodes of an interview series, Norm McDonald has a show. Guests included Letterman, Lorne Michaels, Jane Fonda, and Judge Judy Shandlin. He had limited success in other TV ventures. He created and starred in the ABC sitcom The Norm Show, later shortened to Norm, playing a former NHL player kicked out of the league for gambling and tax evasion and forced into community service as a social worker. A Comedy Central show, sports show with Norm MacDonald, lasted only a handful of episodes, but he kept busy in comedy clubs in my mind, I'm just a stand-up, he told the New York Times in 2018. But other people don't think that. They think, oh, the guy from SNL is doing stand-up now. In a 2011 comedy special, McDonald said it was wrong to say you lost your battle with cancer when you died. 
I'm not a doctor, but I'm pretty sure that if you die, the cancer also dies at exactly the same time, he said. That, to me, is not a louse. That's a drone. Jim Carrey tweeted that McDonald was an honest and courageous comedy genius. Seth Rogen said he essentially ripped off his delivery when he started acting no one could make you break like Norm McDonald, Jon Stewart said on Twitter. Hilarious and unique. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.